building that melts car. It destroys everything around it, and it's impossible to stay close to it. This building melted a Jaguar. This happened in London, and according to reports, it wasn't the first time this building melted a vehicle. The thing is, the building has a, let's say, peculiar shape, cause it's curved and has glass that reflects like a mirror. Some points around the building have sunlight reflected at a specific spot. And if you have your car parked exactly where the sunlight is being reflected, that's it. This didn't just happen to this Jaguar, but also to a bicycle and even into a painting of a building next door. The whole area around the building was cordoned off so that nothing else would melt until they solved the problem. Since only plastic parts of the car were melted, the which was minimal around 1000 pounds. This building can end the life of those in the pool. The employees nicknamed it the Deck Bray. With its glass facade, the Vadera Hotel was built in a concave shape that when hit by sunlight, concentrates heat in a specific area, creating enormous discomfort for visitors. It's more or less the same thing that happened with the building that melted a car. The problem is that in this case, the heat goes straight to the pool, where most guests spend their days. During the building's construction, engineers anticipated the issue and a coating was placed on the glass facade, but it wasn't enough. The temperatures in the pool were so high that some elderly people fell ill and had to be hospitalized. Other guests reported having their hair singed and plastic cups melting during the hottest times of the day. Even the pool water becomes warm and you know what's worse. The architect of this hotel is the same as the one in London. The solution found by management was to increase shaded areas near the pool, which solved the problem. But that's nothing compared to what Disney did. It made entire families abandon their homes. In 2003, the company inaugurated the concert hall in Los Angeles. The building was covered with stainless steel panels that reflected sunlight onto the sidewalks where people were walking. This caused terrible heat. The temperature reached over 60 degrees. People living nearby complained that they had to turn their air conditioning to the maximum to reduce the heat and some even had to move out. And the only way to solve this problem was with sand. How so after sensors identified the panels as the cause of the excessive heat, they were covered with sand to eliminate the reflection of the sunlight. At least these buildings didn't put anyone's life. Unlike this construction here, you're not seeing it wrong. This building is literally lying on the ground. This residential complex in Shanghai toppled over, but remained intact. The curious incident occurred because the project involved excavation on the south side of the building, where an underground garage was to be built, the problem arose. When the builders insisted on piling up the excavated soil on the north side of the building, contrary to the engineers' warnings that this could cause a serious problem, and it did when it started raining, the accumulated soil caused a nearby bed to flow underneath the building, turning the foundation into a quagmire. 